Earlier today, the Department of Justice, joined by 29 states and the District of Columbia, sued Live Nation Entertainment and its wholly owned subsidiary, Ticketmaster, for violating the Sherman Antitrust Act. In recent years, Live Nation Ticketmaster's exorbitant fees and technological failures have been criticized by fans and artists alike. But we are not here today because Live Nation Ticketmaster's conduct is inconvenient or frustrating. We are here because, as we allege, that conduct is anti-competitive and illegal. The result is that fans pay more in fees, artists have fewer opportunities to play concerts, smaller promoters get squeezed out, and venues have fewer real choices for ticketing services. As detailed in our complaint, Live Nation suffocates its competition using a variety of tactics, from acquisitions of smaller regional promoters and venues, to threats and retaliation, to agreements with rivals designed to neutralize them. It is time for fans and artists to stop paying the price for Live Nation's monopoly. It is time to restore competition and innovation in the entertainment industry. It is time to break up Live Nation Ticketmaster. The American people are ready for it.